Good evening and welcome as we celebrate evening prayer for the first Sunday of Advent. Uh, if you don't have a program, they can be found at the entrances. And we invite you to join us tonight as we lift up our voices and our hearts and minds to God uh, during this Advent season. Uh, part of the power of evening prayer uh, comes through repetition, and so I invite you all uh, to join us not only tonight, but for the next two Sundays of Advent, and to maybe bring somebody else with you. Uh, as we begin tonight, I invite everybody to kneel if you are able. Please stand. O oh God, come to my assistance. O oh Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Please be seated. Rejoice, daughter of Zion. Shout for joy, daughter of Jerusalem. Alleluia. The Lord's revelation to my master, sit on my right. Your foes I will put beneath your feet. 
The Lord will wield from Zion your scepter of power. Rule in the midst of all your foes. A prince from the day of your birth on the holy mountains. From the womb before the dawn I begot you. The Lord has sworn an oath he will not change. You are a priest forever. A priest like Melchizedek of old. The master standing at your right hand will shatter kings in the day of his great wrath. He shall drink from the stream by the wayside, and therefore he shall lift up his head. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Rejoice, daughter of Zion. Shout for joy, daughter of Jerusalem. Alleluia. Father, we ask you to give us victory and peace. In Jesus Christ, our Lord and King, we are already seated at your right hand. We look forward to praising you in the fellowship of all your saints in our heavenly homeland. Christ our King will come to us, the Lamb of God foretold by John. When Israel came forth from Egypt, Jacob's sons from an alien people, Judah became the Lord's temple, Israel became his kingdom. The sea fled at the sight, the Jordan turned back on its course, the mountains leapt like rams, and the hills like yielding sheep. Why was it sea that you fled? that you turned back, Jordan, on your course. Mountains that you leapt like rams, hills like yielding sheep. Tremble, O earth, before the Lord, in the presence of the God of Jacob who turns the rock into a pool and flint into a spring of water. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Christ our King will come to us, the Lamb of God foretold by John. <clears throat> Almighty God, ever-living mystery of unity and trinity, you gave life to the new Israel by birth from water and the Spirit and made it a chosen race, a royal priesthood, a people set apart as your eternal possession. May all those you have called to walk in the splendor of the new light render you fitting service and adoration.
I am coming soon, says the Lord. I will give to everyone the reward his deeds deserve. Alleluia, alleluia. Salvation and glory and power to our God. Alleluia. For his judgments are true and just. Alleluia, alleluia. Sing praise to our God, all you his servants. Alleluia. You who fear him, small and great. Alleluia, alleluia. For the Lord our God, the Almighty reigns. Alleluia. Let us rejoice and exult and give him the glory. Alleluia, alleluia. The marriage feast of the Lamb has come. Alleluia. And his bride has prepared herself. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Alleluia. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia, alleluia. I am coming soon, says the Lord. I will give to everyone the reward his deeds deserve. Alleluia, alleluia. Rejoice in the Lord always. I say it again, rejoice. Everyone should see how unselfish you are. The Lord is near. Lord, show us your mercy and love. Lord, show us your mercy and love. And grant us your salvation. Your mercy and love. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Filled the hungry with good things, 
To Jesus Christ, our Redeemer, the way, the truth, and the life, let us make our humble prayer. Son of the Most High, your coming was announced to the Virgin Mary by Gabriel. Come and rule over your people forever. Holy One of God, in your presence, John the Baptist leapt in Elizabeth's womb. Bring the joy of salvation to all the earth. Jesus, the Savior, the angel revealed your name to Joseph, the just man. Come and save your people from their sins. Come and save us, Lord. A light of the world for whom Simeon and all the just waited, come and comfort us. Come and save us, Lord. O rising sun that never sets, Zechariah foretold that you would visit us from above. Come and shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death. Come and stay with us, Lord. Let us also pray tonight for all the people of our parish community, all of us and our families, uh, that this may be truly a time of joyful waiting and that uh, we may truly celebrate the birth of Christ at the Christmas season. Let us pray. Come and stay with us, Lord. And let us pray for peace, uh, that the Prince of Peace who came into the world so long ago uh, might it inspire the hearts of all, especially the leaders of countries involved in war, uh, to turn their hearts away from violence and toward a peaceful resolution to their conflicts. Let us pray. Precepti salutaribus moniti et divina institutione formati. Audemus dicere, Pater noster, qui es in celis, sanctificetum nomen tuum, adveniat renium tuum, fiat voluntas tua, Sicut in cielo et in terra, panem nostrum quotidianum, da nobis odie, et dimite nobis debita nostra, sicut et nos dimitimus debitoribus nostris, Et ne nos inducas in tentationem, sed libera nos amalo. Please be seated. Amen. Uh-huh. 
Please kneel. Antu mergo sacramentum, venere mocenui, et antiquum documentum, no voce da tritui, prestet fide supplementum, Sensum defectui, genitori genitoque, laus et jubilatio, salus honor virtus quoque, sit et benedictio. You have given them bread from heaven. Lord Jesus Christ, you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom, where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The divine praises. Blessed be God. Blessed be his holy name. Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be his most sacred heart. Blessed be his most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the paraclete. Blessed be the great Mother of God, Mary Most Holy. Blessed be our holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be our glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, our most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and his saints.
Thank you all for being here to pray together tonight. And then, you know, start, start in a beautiful way this season of Advent. It was so good taking that quiet half hour time to praise and worship the Lord and offer ourselves to him. This is a beautiful, beautiful prayer of the church. And it is said everywhere in this in the Catholic Church. So when you say the, the prayer, the evening prayer, the morning prayer, we join the universal church right at this time as we pray this prayer, there will be millions praying together. That's the beauty of the prayer of the church. And once again, I thank Rob, Laurie, Dylan, and Katie for helping us to worship the Lord in a meaningful and with a great devotion. Thank you for your hard work. Thank you for your time. God bless you, and have a good night.